And we're expected to feel that cold air, well, sort of cold air, <laughs> right here in South Florida. Cold for us for sure. Counties on the Treasure Coast, they're definitely preparing for these temperatures because they could be in the 30s, even the 20s. Our Caleb Calavano in Martin County as cold weather shelters are opening up, so people aren't, aren't left out in the chill. Well, while the weather feels pretty good right now here in Martin County, in the next few days, it'll be a different story. That's why they're preparing to help out their most vulnerable population. Temperatures are expected to drop to or below 40 degrees for at least four hours on Friday and Saturday overnight. Talking to the Martin County Emergency Management Director Sally Waite, she tells me with these below average temperatures, they want to make sure everyone across the community is safe this Christmas weekend. It's just really important that we make sure we take care of all of our residents in Martin County, especially those that are in need. Um, La Haya House of Hope and Salvation Army are giving out blankets um, and jackets to uh, people that are currently already um, using those services. So I think we really have a good handle on the situation. Across the Treasure Coast, other counties are also starting to take cold weather precautions. On your screen, you can see what plans Indian River County has for the next few days before Christmas. For more information on shelters across the Treasure Coast and when they plan to open these next few days, you can find all of that right now on WPBF.com. In Martin County, Caleb Califano, WPBF 25 News.